We are out on Larimer Street in downtown Denver for our Meet the Delegates series. We have a delegate named Gail Horowitz from Ohio. She's a lawyer. Tell us what your hometown is and what's great about your hometown. Oh, I'm from Cleveland, Ohio, and as you know, Ohio is a really important swing state this election. We have a lot of enthusiastic people, and we're really excited to make a change. I hear that Ohio is less likely to go for Obama than it was for Kerry. Why is that? Oh, I don't think that's true at all. I think people are still just getting to know Senator Obama, and I think that, um, you know, in the 68 days we have left before the election, we're definitely going to spread the word. Um, he's a great candidate, and he really is the change that this country needs. Is that a big problem in, in Cleveland? I keep hearing that phrase, people don't know. Obama. They need to be getting to know Obama. That's right. Well, you know, I think people in Cleveland are, are struggling, a lot of them. There's a lot going on. We're having a terrible foreclosure crisis. Um, people are really working hard to make ends meet, so there's certainly a lot on their minds, unfortunately, besides the presidential election. Um, but I think we'll, we'll get the word out and we'll definitely tell them that uh, Senator Obama can really provide them some help. Whose delegate are you? I'm an at-large delegate um, pledged to Obama, so I guess I'm a statewide at-large delegate. Are you having a lot of fights and arguments with your Hillary delegate friends? No, not at all, actually. One of my good friends is what's called the Hillary Whip, so she's working hard to make sure that um, all of the Hillary folks are on board with us. And actually, all the Hillary folks I've talked to in our delegation are, are right on board. They're working to spread the word, especially among um, female friends, that Senator Obama is the one who cares about uh, pay equity and cares about choice. And um, all the issues that women care about are the ones he cares about. And frankly, the ones that Senator McCain does not care about. What does it mean to you to be a Democrat in 2000? I think being a Democrat today is all about having hope for the future. It's about not giving up. And it's about believing that even though times are tough, there's a lot that we can do to make tomorrow better than today. Who's your favorite Democrat ever? Favorite Democrat ever? Hmm. Well, right now I'm really in love with Nancy Pelosi. I think she's so exciting. I love the fact that she's the first female speaker. It, it means so much to me. When she um, had her first State of the Union where they introduced Madam Speaker, it, it brought tears to my eyes. I think she's amazing. Thanks a lot. Enjoy the convention. Sure.